Lexus GT. And it has, uh, what is this technology here? Uh, we, we use uh, image recognition technology to detect a uh, load of rain and um, uh, the distance control, uh, front car detections, uh, rain detections, and we save the video files too. So when you drive your car, if it's too close, it doesn't allow. Yeah, yeah. It, if you close to front of your car, it makes an alarm. It means a kind of a dangerous situation. Nice. And this is all in here. Yeah. This. Yeah. This is Wi-Fi. Wi-Fi phone. It is working with uh, you know your smartphone. If you install. If you install this smartphone, uh, if you install this Wi-Fi cam in your car, and then if you turn it on your smartphone, it works. To, uh, it can make your smartphone make a you know rain departure warning, for the collision warning, and drive recorder. So you use the CPU of the smartphone to do all this yes. uh, calculation. Yes. You don't use the ARM CPU in here. Well, we use ARM CPU here because we we, are, we have to make you know encoding here. So it's just the video encoding. Yes. And broadcasting on Wi-Fi. Right. Exactly. Uh, which CPU you use? Uh, we are using uh, uh, ARM 11 core. ARM 11 core and uh, uh, 1.0 gigahertz CPUs. 1.0 gigahertz? Yeah. ARM 11? Yeah. And uh, what is the resolution of this video when it broadcasts? Uh, actually, we have two types. One is uh, for uh, 720 d D1 grade. The other is uh, HD 1, uh, 1280 uh, multiple 720. Yeah. So D1 grade and 720? Yes. HD? Yeah, HD. Uh, what is the bit rate to broadcast that? Uh, here is Wi-Fi cam, smartphone, uh -huh. app solution. What's the bit rate? Uh, actually, I don't remember the exact bit rate, but you know. It works. Yeah, it works. It works inside the car. Yeah, no, of course, of course. No it products. makes it makes almost 20 frames. Yeah. Yeah. So basically, you use the phone to see the video in live. Yeah. And then the in phone app will render. Yeah, this exactly. Stuff. Yeah, exactly. So it is a new concept. Also, new new products, and the phone will record everything. Uh, phone. Actually, phone recorded it. Also, this Wi-Fi can record it too. But so you got this information. Yeah, you can. Just only the video. Yeah, only video. But I really like this this kind of stuff. Does it work? Mm -hmm. Are you do you have do you use it every day on your car? Yeah, of course. And uh, it really works. Yeah, we do OEM too. So you do uh, OEM. What does that mean? Uh, we supply this product car manufacturer directly. They put it inside the car. Yeah, yeah exactly. O not only Korean cars. Uh, Korean cars. Korean cars. Yes. So maybe there's a Hyundai or Daewoo or something with, a, with yeah. this inside. Yeah, maybe. So, yeah, maybe. The secret which one? Yeah. Yes. Sangyong Motor Company. The what? Sangyong Motor Company. We supply this product as an OEM. Nice. And you have uh, Android? No, it is uh, uh, based by you know Linux. Linux. Yeah. It looks similar to. Uh, uh, when, we when see you, yeah. Uh, so, uh, your technology is only for range detection and what else? Uh, we detect uh, two lines over the lead, over the load, and we detect front car. Also, we save the video files exactly. So, we could make three functions at the same time. So, here's the crazy idea. I'm guessing this is really crazy, but. Uh, could this be a self-driving car power station through the mobile phone? You know, if you connected this to the steering wheel mm -hmm. and connected to the speeder, mm -hmm. somehow, I don't know how, with some motors, yeah, anyway. and the smartphone app could actually run the car. Yeah. What do you think? I don't know. You don't but know? you can try. Could you try? I'm not sure yet. Are you interested? It might be. You know. Might be. Yeah. But what are you doing in the future otherwise, the company? Uh, actually, we, uh, actually, we are uh, we uh, we wanted to collect uh, all car data from the car because we are using you know OBD2 uh, modules to collect uh, whole data. Also, we uh, calculate an analysis drivers' habit. At yeah. the same time, we can make uh, some kind of data. So the habits. Mm -hmm. We can analysis habits and behavior when they drive, and then we can make data for the insurance company or transportation company, something like that.
what would be nice is if you could record mm -hmm. uh, sound yep. and say to your wife, slow down, you're crazy. You can make it? You can yeah. already. No, but you can make it. You it is a kind it. of idea. Also, we can support this solution to the uh, uh, smartphone navigation map company, like Google, like Waze, because in their map, if we add our solution to their map solution to integrate each other, it might be you know, better functions to the drivers. So it would say, turn left, turn left, get on a lower, lower traffic road. Yes, something like that. Something like that. Yeah. And, uh, and uh, it should send an email to the husband every time the wife drives like crazy to send an automatic email. Also, if you use our smartphone solution, your wife can watch your, your driving situation through his, her smartphone in real nice. time. In real time, she yeah. can see the road. Yeah, where are you? Something like that. That's good. Also, maybe, yeah. maybe, maybe this is a good solution for parents who borrow their exactly. car to the children. Exactly. And they want to record a yeah. whole trip. They yeah. say, you can use okay. my Ferrari, uh -huh. but you let me see how you drive. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. And see, you let me get an email yeah. if you drive too fast. Yeah, right. I understand. You killed someone. Or, yeah. yeah. So it is, you know, good, you know, solution to the, you know, kind of a novice driver or, you know, something like that.